Hello, my name is Cherry, and in this video we will show you how to punch holes in the Artinus headcaps. We will discuss the basic template configurations, perfect punching technique and the associated safety regulations. For more advanced information, please contact us via askforinfo at artinus.com. In this video you will need the neoprene Artinus headcap, the punching toolkit which is included in your FNIRS device purchase, it consists of a punch pad, a punch and a neoprene test sheet to try your first punches, a hammer and an idea of your desired template. Before we start hammering holes in our head cap, we need to have a basic understanding of the opto template. Opto templates consist of three components. Transmitters, represented by yellow dots. Receivers, represented by blue dots. And channels, represented by a line with a white dot connecting the transmitter and the receiver. The graphic representation in the manual and OxySoft will be translated onto the cap. Since this is a two-dimensional template placed over a three-dimensional head, it might appear as if discrepancies occur but this is due to the default 30mm between transmitter and receiver. If we interconnect all 10 transmitters and 8 receivers of the bright system, we can create up to 27 channels. Instead, we can also create multiple sub-templates in one opto-template. For example, 2x12 channels or 2x4 and 2x5 channels. The head caps come with a pre-printed outline of the 30mm indications. For Artinus templates, you can use these, but you are of course free to design and mark your own template. Make sure your workspace is in line with the recommendations from the punching toolkit and put on your noise cancelling ear protection. Place the punch pad on a flat, rigid surface with the instructions facing down. If you know where you want to make the hole in the head cap, position your head cap to assure there is only one layer of neoprene between your punch pad and the punch press. Place the punch and one firm hit with the hammer should be enough to cut through the neoprene. After you punched all needed holes, you can place the optode holders, the optodes and you are all set for your measurements. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos. If you have any questions, have a look in the manual or contact us via askforinfo at artinus.com.